want to get them want to get on me and today i'm be talking about funko ween eh? since you guys all know eh, that this whole week uh is funko ween so you know what that means that funko's gonna be announcing all these new funko pops that are pretty much halloween related you know so uh yeah man without further ado me let's begin let's dive into what they announced so far so far funko themselves haven't announced that much eh? but there there is uh, like some Funkos that have been leaked eh? that are gonna be uh, coming out eh? so I'm pretty sure they're gonna announce them during this whole week or whatever eh? but uh, yeah man I want to say shout out to these dot pops on me on IG man that fool, I don't know how that fool gets all this info way but that fool hey, go follow that on IG way that fool puts you up on game of what's coming out when and when it's available for pre-order everything way you will not be disappointed eh? so first let's talk about these uh, new Dia de los Muertos Funko Pops which I gotta say uh, Shout out to you, Funko Man. I really dig this whole concept. Which these were already leaked a while back, eh? But we didn't get like a, a good image of them until now, eh? As you see in the image right there, they look super dope, eh? But I do have one issue with these, eh? Is that they, you, they're freaking recycling the same Batman and Joker and Harley Quinn molds. Like, I don't know if it's just me or other people feel the same way, eh? That these molds are, you know, are, are getting boring, way. Eh? They need to switch it up. And the same thing goes with uh, with Marvel, you know? They freaking recycle the same molds. All they do just give them a different paint job, way. Eh? But you know what? Overall, man, they look super dope, way. Eh? I'm going to end up copying all of these. Maybe. I'm still thinking about if I should get the Batman and the Joker one, way. Eh? But you know what? Knowing me, man, you know, I'm a big DC fan. I'm going to end up copying this whole set, man. But my favorite one from all of these has to be that Bane, man. Look at that Bane. Sick, eh? Which, that's actually the same mold, too, man, from the... Uh, what pop did he... Um, from the uh, DC Legion of Collectors uh, box or whatever. They had an exclusive Bane pop in there. And that's exactly the same mold, eh? Which I don't mind, eh? Because, you know, you don't really get that many Bane pops, eh? But that pop looks super dope. And then that Blue Beetle next to him. That Blue Beetle looks sick, too, way. Eh? And then you're getting Jessica Cruz. Which I wish they could have gave was a regular Jessica Cruz pop, man. But you know what? I'll take that one. I'm a green is my favorite color, eh? So, you know what? I have to rock with that. Jessica Cruz. And then next to her, you're going to get that Harley Quinn with the same old mold, you know? And then uh, Flash on the top, eh? Which that Flash looks pretty sick, too, eh? I was taking off, eh? But, uh, yeah, man, I'm moving on. Some Marvel goodness, eh? Uh, and I called it on this one, eh? On these new Marvel Zombie Pops. I knew they were going to freaking make most of them glow in the dark, eh? And you know what? I was right, man. I'm glad I didn't cop the freaking common Thor uh, zombie. Because look at as you see in the image there. They're going to make that full glow, way. Eh? I knew it. I know how Funko, you know, I know how Funko functions, way. Eh? They try, try to, uh, you know, they try to make that bread, way. Eh? Which, you know what? I, I ain't even mad at you, man. You know, get your hustle out, way. Eh? But, ah, you ain't getting me. And, uh, yeah, man, they're going to make a a glow in the dark freaking um zombie thor which i'm hoping they do a glow in the dark freaking morak man hopefully but uh yeah man moving on they're gonna be releasing that hulk way which that one's gonna be releasing this thursday on the 27th uh so you gotta go to your local hot topic early in the morning hopefully you know they have some chases and if you can't make it to your local hot topic then you could go online eh because i've heard that it's gonna be releasing online and in stores on the 27th day eh? so you know what since i'm gonna be working that day I want to be ready, man. I want to buy me like five and, you know, play that little chase roulette way. Because I really want that Red Hulk, man. Because I know there's like an SDCC one and the anxiety. What is it? Um, exclusive where it's half and half in his metallic way. Oh, that one looks like the compound Hulk one. But, uh, yeah, man, I, I'm really digging that Red Hulk, man. And then moving down to the bottom, you see they're going to make that Kingpin freaking... um. Minimize a uh, kingpin, which that one looks super dope, man. Not super dope. I don't know. I'm still kind of iffy if I should cop it, eh? But one thing I do like, eh, is that they didn't put the tongue on them, eh? Because I was getting tired of them putting freaking that Venom tongue on every Venomized pop. Like, we get it. He's Venom, eh? But do you really necessarily need to put a freaking tongue on every freaking Venomized pop, eh? Relax, eh? But, yeah, man, that kingpin looks pretty pretty dope, man. I might cop it. But the one that I'm most definitely going to end up copying is the one next to him, eh? You get Jack-O-Lantern as freaking Ghost Rider way, which I'm hoping they make that full freaking glow in the dark, man. Fingers crossed, finger crossed. Like that won't make sense if they make them glow in the dark or make a chase glow, you know, like they did the Red Hulk. But I, I doubt it, man. They're gonna make that full glow. Maybe in the future, you know, they try to get that paper, eh? But uh, yeah, oh, and by the way, none of these have a release date yet. Well, except our Red Hulk, obviously, is gonna be releasing in May 27th, this up and coming Thursday. And the other ones that I haven't uh, announced it, I'm pretty sure they'll announce it in the up and coming weeks or whatever, eh? Because some of these are for, available for pre-order, like some of the Disney villains, eh? They're going to be releasing and stuff like that, which we'll get into those in a little bit. And uh, moving on, eh? Oh, you're going to get the homie Fluffy, homie. The same concept, the other Los Muertos, eh? 
which I'm most definitely gonna end up copying this one, eh? This one looks super sick, eh? I like Fluffy, man. He, his specials are freaking funny and freaking Netflix. If you guys haven't watched them, go check them out, eh? And I know he has a freaking TV show also, man. So, I, and my brother watches it. He says it's pretty good. So, you know what? I have to, you know, watch that show or whatever. But yeah, man, I love this Fluffy, man. I like how he's all white painted and you've got that little, you know, the other little muerto design or whatever. And he's holding the mic. That's right, homie. And uh, moving on to some Disney villains, eh? Which they're gonna be releasing a Funko Shop exclusive, Corella. And then next to him, I don't even know who them fools are, homie, with the little black hats, eh? But there's gonna be a common one, and then I'm uh, gonna be a box lunch exclusive, Glow, eh? And then the bottom, you're gonna get freaking Hades, eh? Which is gonna be a Hot Topic, Hot Topic exclusive. It's gonna be a Target exclusive, eh? Now moving on, eh, to some more Disney villains, eh? You're gonna get another Maleficent pop, another Cruella, that freaking pirate from Peter Pan, eh? And the other two highness, I'm not too familiar with who they are. I'm pretty sure one of them's from Snow White, eh? And then the other one on the bottom, I don't know who she is, eh? But yeah, man, these, I think, they're already available for pre-order, man. And then I'm uh, moving on, eh, to some Michael Myers goodness, eh? Which these, I was super pumped, eh, when I heard they're gonna be releasing new Michael Myers pops, eh? But you know, when I look at them, I'm like, really, wait? They look exactly the same as the ones they released previously, way. I know there was the Hot Topic exclusive one, which he's holding a knife like this on that one. I gotta double check, though, if, I, if, you know, if I'm correct or not, eh? But I'm pretty sure it is a little bit different, eh? But as you can see, there's gonna be a regular common one, and then another one's gonna be Amazon exclusive, which is gonna be a bloody one or whatever, which that one was actually available for pre-order today for a while and then it went away but don't worry man if you're interested in getting this one you know amazon will have it back up on on the website or whatever and then they're gonna be restocking the freaking fye exclusive way hey i have a feeling funko's gonna end up freaking restocking all these og pops man and you know what it's gonna suck way for some pops that are you know that worth money or whatever and then they restock them way and the, like i think they re they recently restocked the Attack on Titans way, which those were catching steam way. They're going up in value way, and then that Funko restocks them. <laughs> God, throw it, eh? And then they're actually going to be making a jumbo size freaking uh, Michael Myers, eh? Pretty much like a 10 inch. Which again, there's going to be. It's the same mold as the common one, as you've seen in the other image. And then there's going to be a specialty series, which is going to be the bloody one, eh? Which, uh. If I was you, I would just get the regular, you know, 4-inch one, Wait, Do you really need a 10-inch Michael Myers? Wait, hell no, nah, I'll scare the shit out of me, way at night. And, um, you know, I need to these pops that caught me off guard, way these Mandy pops. And if you guys aren't familiar with Mandy, it was pretty much a, a horror film, way. It's kind of like an indie film, you know, like a low-budget film, but it's freaking great. And it stars Nicolas Cage, way, which you don't see Nicolas Cage starring in, like, big-budget films anymore. He pretty much does a bunch of indie stuff, which is freaking great, man. I don't know, I love all Nicolas Cage's films, way. Like, this Mandy one is a horror film. Oh, man, it's freaking creepy. In the end, it gives you... It get, gets you thinking, like, what, what, what happened, wait? But it's a crazy film, man. I recommend you guys go check out this uh, Mandy uh, movie, man. And you're going to get, like, a regular uh, common, freaking Nicolas Cage. And then you're going to get, like, all red Nicolas Cage. And then you're going to get his wife. You're going to get, like, a regular common one. And then next to you see that Chase, which is all red. And I'm not sure if the one that's all red is going to be also a Chase for Nicolas Cage or not. But there's no Chase sticker next to him. So I'm pretty sure it's just going to be a common one, eh? But yeah, man, these I'm most definitely gonna end up copy, man. That film was great. I'm surprised they even did them, eh? And lastly, way they're gonna be releasing some uh, Paka Paka Funko Pops, eh? Which I'm not too familiar with, with where these fools are from, eh? Is this from an anime show or what, eh? But they're gonna be releasing some Pops, eh? Which these, I did see them at Hot Topic, eh? And they're available for pre-order if you guys are interested in any of these. And they're gonna be releasing some plushies, eh? And there's gonna be like a little backpack. And uh, moving on, there's gonna be some like mini say eh, of these Paka Paka 2 way, eh? which they look pretty cute. Eh? I ain't even gonna lie. Eh? And uh, yeah, man, that's pretty much it. Eh? What they announced, eh? and what some of the images that were leaked or whatever. And if they announce any more like cool stuff during this week, eh, I'll do another video, a quick little rundown of what they announced that day or whatever. Eh? And once again, man, if you guys enjoy uh, my videos, man, you like Funko hunts, Funko reviews, and a little bit of comic books, way, right? then you're in the right spot, way. Right? Subscribe to my channel, way. Right? Don't forget to hit that like. Follow me on IG at streak underscore 89er player. And uh, streak 89er. I'll play ya.